Robert, I have known Michael mm -hmm. since he was born. Mm -hmm. And we used to work together when he was really little. Mm -hmm. And I'm so proud of him Thank you. that he's able to come mm -hmm. here today okay. and talk to everybody about mm -hmm. himself and autism and his point of view about autism. Hard. One of the things that Michael is very sensitive about Talk is when out. people laugh. So I'm going to ask you not to laugh. It's if you feel really like something's funny, you need to hold it in because Michael takes it personally, okay? Give me a thumbs up if you understand what I've said. Thank you. Michael's gonna chat. I'm gonna ask him some questions. He's gonna answer some questions. He's gonna show you a book. We'll tell you about that after. If you have questions, at the end, when Michael's finished, I will give you a paper. You can write down the question. I will read it. Michael will answer it. Aye. Thumbs up if we understand. Perfect. Perfect. Perfecto. You ready to go? Yes. Okay. Presentation will have you show. Let's start with. With me? Yes. So, so hi, my name is Michael Tanzer. I'm 31 years old and I'm a long time graduate from Thornley Secondary School. I attended high school from 2006 to 2011. I like to ball with my friends on every Thursday and I'm trying my best on spreading autism awareness as a self advocate. And I even wrote a book about when I was growing up on the spectrum. It took me about two years in the making. It's called Michaelism, My POV on Life with Autism. Very impressive, isn't it, huh? Yes. yes. And I wrote a book. If you guys, if you guys want to check it out, you can buy it on Amazon or at Indigo if you guys want to. But they can buy it here today too. Really? Yeah. All right. We have some for them. All right. So, anyways. Should we get going? Yep. Okay, Michael. How would you explain what autism is? Oh yeah, my brain is wired differently. I may struggle with things like, for example, I, it's a mixture of blessing and a cursing to one. I hate when people laugh at me or if I'm being radical because radical is bad. I think that part was really important when you said it's a blessing and a curse. Yeah, kind of like Spider Man, ain't it? Anyways. What's it like living with autism? It makes me unique and gifted and talented at the same time. Think about it. I'm good at languages. For example, I soft talk Japanese and some French on my own. But I had a very hard time making new friends with the same interests as me. Most days I can be really happy and positive and outgoing while I'm trying my best as I can. I think I'm too personally, don't give up, just keep what you're doing. Always. Oh, wait a minute, where are you going? Oh, oh sorry. <laughs> I wish you all oh, good luck. See ya. Thank you. Bye. Right. Bye. See you later, Oh, carry on. When did your parents find out you had autism? My parents had an idea about two years old because I had no eye contact, no speech. I cried a lot, stemmed, but not many people come near me. I officially become diagnosed at the age of three. Well, uh, it's a long story, but true. Demo, hotel this y'all now. Michael, one of the questions, can I ask you an off-script question? Yeah. Which we don't have here. It says that you didn't talk. Can you tell everyone how you did communicate? I communicate, oh yeah. I communicate through my voice. Before you your voice? Before you yes, before with my pictures, before I can speak. And don't get me wrong, but it's a long story. And I came out such a long way. A really long way. Exactly. A really long way. What are some things you like about being autistic? And what are some things that are difficult? Oh yeah, I have a full graphic memory as well as having very expert computer typing skills. And I can learn foreign languages very easily. Like me, like French or Korean or Hindu, for example. Namaste? I or Anyo or Sanahe. I'm very positive, Yay. friendly, and outstanding with the ability to understand human sarcasm. Yay. Some things that make me feel negative are I wish I was more independent, 
like you guys. I could learn how to drive. I'm a career of my life, and I want to get better at that. Tell me, cash or money. Why do people stim a lot? To why to calm them down, of course. I still use my fidget toy or fidget spinner, for example, or listen to Spotify through my headphones or watch videos on the computer when I'm feeling bored. You know. Did you bring your fidget toy set? Just. Oh no, no never mind that. <laughs> okay. Can I see both? I actually. What's stimming? Yeah, okay. well, one of us again. Well, stimming is when. Yes, exactly. It's more, it's more like a repetitive behavior, if you ask me. A repetitive behavior? Exactly. Okay, do you have a way that you like to stim? When it comes to music, I would tap my fingers to the sound of drum. I do that too. Really? Nice! I knew you would say that. Uh, what's your name again? Kimino Namoa? Miss Kasner. Miss, uh, Miss, Miss K. Kasner. Miss Kasner. Oh. This is Miss Kasner's school. I haven't had a chance to introduce wow. you yet. We also, if I can introduce you, you didn't bring it today, but there's these little keychain things that are like plastic, mm -hmm. and he fiddles like with it. Oh, great, yeah. I know. A little spin flies. Yeah. Yes. All right. What is something you wish everyone knew about autism? We people on the spectrum, like me, have our brains wired differently with lots of support, time, and patience. Of course, we can achieve many things because time is everything we need to learn. There's a way of acceptance of who we are because we are born this way. I am who I am. Michael is my name, and I'm proud to be on the spectrum. We are smarter and funnier than people giving us credit for. So remember, kids. Don't purse down and give us a chance. So this is the book I wrote. It's called My Wisdom, My POV on Life with Autism. It took me about two years in the making. Well, technically, my longtime therapist, Janet, did help me on some parts as well. For example, you can see a whole lot of drawings I made inside one book. For example, it says, oh, allow me. Check it out, huh? Very impressive, ain't it? And there's my favorite. Okay, let's see. It's just some Japanese inside it. Michael, tell them how you started Japanese. Since high school. To the Japanese Canadian Culture Center, of course. Do you have a question? Oh, raise your hand. You can tell Michael. Ohio. Michael. Michael. Ohio. 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 Michael uh, chose Japanese at uh, the Technical Cultural Center, Japanese Cultural Center at high school. Uh, he did anybody else have a high school? Anybody wanted to continue? So he did right to the end. He got the high school. Nice guy. It's true. All right, all right. It's it's here. Joka, Bogoroshi Tekurasai. Get please get to know me. All right. If, oh, check out. Uh, for example, I did drawings or illustrations. What do you, what, what do you, call, you. want to call it? Uh, there. Oh. Awesome. Right? Wow. Those are drawings of Pokemon characters. For example, there's a there's. The Michael also took a... There's Pikachu. Oh, oh. There's, there's Pikachu. To, took a beat. And Chi. Yeah. Mike, can I tell him the other thing? So sure. Michael took um, professional DJ lessons, which he really loved. And it's difficult because the coordinating the two hands. So he really does, he does it at home. He does his own music. 
he took a photography course at Seneca College. It's true. He took a lot of computer courses, private computer so much courses. Better. Exactly. And uh, this is Michael's mother, yeah. Kathy. Her name is Kathy Tanzer. Get, get, get the nor, you guys. <laughs> <laughs> so. And right now, um, Brock University, my older son goes there, but it's not because of my son. Um, the psychologist, one of the psychologists got a hold of Michael's book, and she uses it in her psychology class. And Michael's been on Zoom meetings with the students there, answering questions and doing his presentations. And he has another presentation in April with the Brock University. Okay, Mike, I have some questions here. All right. If you think that, um, I'll ask you. And if you think you do or don't want it asked, answer. All right, before that, it's time for our Japanese 101. Follow me and you will to learn some Japanese for me. Repeat after me. Konnichiwa. Konnichiwa. Haru. Haru. Natsu. Natsu. Aki. Aki. Fuyu. Fuyu. Ichigatsu. Ichigatsu. Nigatsu. Nigatsu. Sangatsu. Sangatsu. Shigatsu. Shigatsu. Gogatsu. Gogatsu. Roku Gatsu. Roku Gatsu. You're doing great, kids. She got. Oh, sorry, sorry. She she got to. She she got to. And she got to. And she got to. Who got to? Who got to? Who got to? Who got to? Who e she got to? Who e she got to? Who e got to? Who e got to? What a brave Tom Trace is, ain't it? Yeah. Oh, and there's my favorite. Mono got. Tari. Monogatari. Mean story in Japanese. Can I ask you some questions now? Sure. Okay. So one student said, I also like DJ and I like to sing songs. Yay. That's what someone said. Somebody else asked, how many pages is your book? 64, actually. Michael, you also tell him you, you like to sing Japanese music. I like to, I like to do Japanese to myself when it comes to a computer to myself at home. I know. Yeah. He's very, but he sings all, he watches Japanese television. Or Japanese dramas, actually. Japanese dramas, so does my mom. And he sings really? Japanese songs. That's all she watches. That is so um, One student asked why you don't like it when people laugh. Because I'm very sensitive, it's a long story. But I will try to overcome it. He's sensitive. It makes him feel like he's being laughed at. Or, or very close, but I'm trying my best to overcome it. You know. Another student said they have the same name as you. Really? Michael. Michael. Nice! Thanks! Michael, what's your Japanese name? Michael. Michael. And my nickname is My Tanza. Got it memorized. <laughs> That's Axel talk for you. Another interesting question, Michael. Someone asked, is everyone with autism the same? Ms. Eagle, could you read that again? Is everyone with autism the same? <laughs> Anyone else? Wait your hand up. Oh, Galante wants to answer. Um, no, because autism is something that varies. Like, one person can have autism where they can't speak, and then someone else can have autism and they can speak perfectly. Well said, Bods. What's your name again? Valente. Valente. Survive. Cool name, huh? Really? That was well said. Someone else asked, how is a day in your life? Yes. I would wake up and shower and brush my teeth. And I took my clothes before I shower. 
It, it's it's my it's my morning routine okay. thing. You have different acts on different days, right? Right. Do you want to tell them some of the acts? Like you do? swimming, uh, helping my parents <laughs> with the furniture and stuff, and I go on the treadmill as well too. Can you volunteer? And I oh I volunteer on Tuesdays at my dad's hospital called North York General Hospital. Oh, for how long? Since 2013. It's very well known there. Yep, and it's true. And okay, on Thursdays, you told them what you like to do. I like to bowl with my friends at Splitsville. In order to know, it, it was once no, for for me to know as World Bowl before it began in Splitsville. He's been bowling with the same boys since grade nine in high school. They're his high school friends. Every Thursday they bowl. They don't miss. Anything else about your? Daily life. That you want to talk about. I like to I like to talk with friends on Messenger or video chat as well too. Uh -oh. Adam, if you have a question, you're gonna write it down. Do you wanna write it down? And right now, I'm currently aiming for my Hollywood dream to start my own software sequel series. That I might warn you kids, as a lot of right, it's TVMA. So don't watch unless if you're 18. Understood? No. I knew you would say that, bud. That drone. All right. No, you you're sitting just for now. Right they didn't see that here. Mm -hmm. um, another question. Mm -hmm. Did no, autism affect you in any other way? Let's like, think, for example, I would say, I would say, oh. mood swings. Oh. That's good. Can you kind of explain that? What is a mood swing? Yeah. Does anyone know all about mood swings? Yeah. Well, oh, when it comes to anxiety attacks, I would, I would be in my room all alone. Oh, anyone? Well, I'm, I have to try my best to overcome mood swings. But sometimes, when it comes to days like that, I would smile on the outside and I cry on the inside. So Michael's saying when he, when he has, when he feels a lot of anxiety, he's trying to work on it, but he's feels really upset inside, but he's trying not to show it. Exactly. Right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. How about when you went to school? Was school easy or hard for you? It was a kind of hard but easy for me. What was easy and what was hard? Easy was, was meeting new, new teachers and making new friends. It was a little hard for me, but I survived. And I did get pretty good grades. It was, uh, and I did good. I graduated from 2011, right? If you're showing me this, we can move back. Okay, another question here. Do you like soccer? Uh, no, I, my favorite, I like to watch hockey games. As well as baseball games too, you know? In person or on TV. I love Toronto Maple Leafs. Then I'll make a way to roll dice and use it. Oh, I will drive one day. What's going to from driving? My seizures. Yeah. Yeah, it's a long story. You didn't have the seizures once in a while, like every couple of years, like small ones? Uh, then all of a sudden he had really a grand mall and uh, they were really bad. And so he ended up uh -oh. uh, being no. put on seizure medication. I know. So at that point, he's going to drive. And he would like to drive. He's a really good go-karter. He abides by the road. Uh, so one day. One day, right? Yeah. Joshua, no. Someone else said they also no, like to chat with their friends, friends on yeah. Messenger. Anyone else? Yeah. Oh, I think good, right? Nice. I use Twitter a lot, as well as LinkedIn too. And Michael, you always communicate too with people outside of the country, like you have friends in South Dakota. South Dakota. And where else? You make friends all over the world, right? Yeah. Exactly. Michael, I have a question. Do you want to write it down? Yeah. Or was it written to me? I wanna. Is it a comment or a question? Okay. Yeah. Oh. Perhaps, or perhaps one of us will explain. Or Andrea or my mom can explain it to you. Do you remember, Kintara, when we talked about seizures before? What did I tell you it means? It means you 
Shape. Means shape, right. And, and you, after you shake and you, whatever, you, you actually pass out and you sleep for a while. Turbine. Michael would generally sleep for two or three hours. You couldn't wake up. Turbine. Through a blackout. Turbine. Yeah. Turbine. Somebody asked if you know how to speak Spanish. Uh, no, actually. I do prefer French and Japanese. Like, merci beaucoup, et toi, kimima, omae, watash, boku, dayo. Okay? Do you have a question or a comment, Adam? Oh, long story. How long do you end at the hospital if you have a surgery? Like, how many days do you end? Are you at the hospital if you have a surgery? Michael didn't have any surgeries. He was driving. Well, it's not. No, he didn't drive. Well, it's not. I know this top two right here. You see, I went to the top of the shop and I got this autism symbol infinity. Pretty cool, isn't it? Yeah. Tell them about your family. Uh -oh. I love my mom. Well, no, about yeah. your whole family. Well, I have one too. Wow. Right? right? And Jesse. Yeah. Jesse. Michael's, Michael's brother and mom and dad, dad will be. And dad will be. And my dad, he happens to be a long time doctor. His name is Dr. Russell Tanzer. Uh -oh. And he works at North Age General Hospital for a long time. Do you want to show them your tattoo? That's how you respect. That's how you represent autism. So, Kathy and Michael brought along a lot of pictures and um, activities that he did when he was younger. When Michael was, Michael didn't say this in his presentation, but he taught himself how to read before he was even talking. That's me, by the way, as my younger. We used to show Michael flashcards to teach back. him the names of things like a book or a bathtub or an elephant. Yeah. And one day we turned over all the flashcards and they had the words on the back. And we said, go find elephant. And Michael was three years old and wasn't even talking yet. And he picked up the card that said elephant. And we thought, what? So we tried again with another word, and then he picked up that word. Yes, now I see. He went, what? I talked to him. And Michael was reading. He taught himself how to read, and he couldn't even say words yet. All right. So his mom used to show him what everything was and have the word. For example, the word it. bed. And there's my favorite swimming. I taught him. And there's a uh, the park. And there's the sandbox, for example. And also anything that his older brother did, um, he made Michael do. Like if he, if his brother was skating or playing hockey, Michael Musiku? had to do it. Michael, he had to do everything. Rollerblading, Computer? hockey, skating, swimming. And then he could decide if he didn't want to do it. Yeah. He can ride a bicycle. And, and Should we show them a picture of me and him? Yeah. And another skill that Michael had, and Andrea knows, when he started to write, he would write with both hands. He would like spell a word backwards, and then he'd spell the next word backwards with the other hand. So he was writing with both hands. And at that point, the doctor said that we have to sort of force him to go with one hand. So we forced him to go with the right hand because it's more prominent. But he was constantly and even like in grade one, if he had a spelling test, he got every word right. He never made a mistake on a spelling word. Can I talk to you? Uh, okay, we're getting it some camera. Getting it all. Michael, while Miss Hill finds that photo, I have a question I wrote down. Yes, sure. Is it okay if I read it in seven years mm -hmm. My question is, what does it mean to have Darcy. a photographic memory? It means to remember anything and recognize it at the same time. That's Can you give us an example? For example, Can I, I would see. Don't do that. I would watch Bob's Burgers. I remember every character and some lines. But also if, with the movie, like if he's seeing a movie, he remembers like who wrote it, who directed it, who the characters were. Like, of every movie to this day. Snow, that must have been a really good thing for school. Yeah. Oh, yeah. 
and like Not there was some geography particularly um if he the teachers had a map you know you have to no. fill in the blanks yeah. he would get them perfect because he would just look at them out the first time see all the names the time was so strong did everybody hear that yeah, yeah. yeah. Well, I'm the well, well, hope you guys have learned learn something for, for me yeah. 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 okay i'll call him don't call him he's not feeling very happy I have a blog. Let me go search the real Mecca Dancer blog. Do you want to Well, here's one of me and my girl swimming. Aww. See? We found it. <laughs> there, was, there was another one. Do we want this first? Miss Siegel, I wonder yeah. how old you are. Ah! <laughs> what, what is that? Is it okay if I walk around and show everyone? Thank you, Stu. Yeah, mm -hmm. Mom, yes, too. Yeah. And this, why don't you tell them about this, too? My, I, this is called here. My Relaxation Michael, Book. Michael, you can move away. For example, not it's cool, cool, Back relax. Things I need to do when I am upset, mad, frustrated, yada, yada, yada. I need to, one, relax, calm down. Don't Six, on him. Squeeze my hands tight. Don't try him. Two, don't I should take a him. deep breath. You're quiet. Now. Oh. Now hold your breath, blow out air, relax. Close my eyes. Think of my favorite movie or something. I feel good now. I need to talk calmly and quietly. Yep, I did a good job. And what not? And that's how the book works. So when Michael was at school and he was having a bad day, instead of um, having an outburst, he had this book and he would write inside the book how he was feeling, if he was mad, mad, or if he was angry, upset. This is from almost two, there. Two, 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 three, by the way. He would express himself in words because he always, it was an easier For thing finish. having an outburst. We'll finish the question here that I missed. How do you draw Pokemon? I, I, I search, I learned it from, from the internet, of course. Cool, you can say yours out loud if you want to. Oh, really? You can just say it. Oh. Like you said about the movies, where are you seeing the scene with you when I watch the chairs back downstairs? Do you want to go watch the movies? The chairs downstairs. Do you want to go put them back on which movie are you doing? Okay. I gotta say, like, uh, Guardians of the Galaxy. I see that you're behaving perfectly. Nice. Which one? The first one? Uh, I yeah. I see the first. I see the movie. Yeah, I saw the second one. Nice. Okay. Another question, Michael. What is your favorite movie? I'm, I can't think of a favorite actually, but no, no favorites. I don't have any favorites. What's your favorite program? I would say South Park. I know that I know the the episodes, seasons, but trust me, you won't like it. That was a lot of swearing. Not suitable for you guys, but for adults only. I can't start. Another question. Did you skip a few grades? Mm. I didn't. No offense, but I didn't. Anything else that you want to show them or talk about? Any other questions or comments? Augie, do you have something to say? No? Michael? Do you, are you a fan of Nintendo? Yes. My favorite console has to be the Nintendo Switch. I love Nintendo too. One of my favorite games has to be Mario Kart. I love so Animal weird. Crossing and Mario Fire Emblem and Kittergris and Mario too. Nice. Don't, don't, don't. Okay.
Alex Smash Bros. I just realized something. There's a way you can say Alex in Japanese. So, so repeat after I say it. Ready? Let me see. Ready, everyone? Yeah. Yeah. He show. He show. Nice. Yes. Right. Right. Dance. 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 I'm just making that announcement. That's all. Yeah. That's wonderful. Now I'm gonna post it also. Oh, oh. Yes. Yeah. It was it was just me and you guys. Thank you for coming. Thank you so much for coming. Done. I used up that. Nice job. Okay.